She's 16 years old and working on the dream of reaching the Olympics. On the ice, Germany's Tanya Shevchenko. difficult in this program, a triple Lutz. A little tilted, but she, she saved what she could. Shevchenko, the daughter of the couple who own a small taxi company in their hometown of Dusseldorf, Germany, has chosen Spanish music to skate to. Katarina Vitt now will compete against her. And she's actually looking forward to it. to see someone like Tanya, so young, skating with such confidence, poise, and maturity. Is this good enough to win? It's pretty strong. She didn't have the difficulty of Jose Schwinnard, but she skated a lot cleaner. Tanya Shevchenko, who was third entering the free skate, and again, the free skate results count two-thirds of the final score. Another look at the triple lutz. She'll reach back with her left leg. She jumps the other direction. It's like skating left-handed. One, two, three there. A little tilt on the landing, but she did the best she could to salvage whatever she could out of that jump. You can see right here. Triple sow cow. Three rotations and she fights for the landing. Now the first set of marks, technical merit. 
And these aren't too bad, five, six, five, seven. She skated pretty clean. The one problem she did have on the triple Lutz jump, I think, cost her a little bit. Uh, if anything, any skater that beat her did the triple Lutz and a triple flip. So all in all, not too bad. I think the judges now are rewarding more for difficulty than they, for, than they are for cleanliness. And the marks for artistic impression. And these go down. I'm kind of surprised because she does skate with a lot of poise and maturity for someone of her age. I like the program. It's well balanced. The jumps are well placed. Well, for the moment, that puts Tanya Shevchenko in third place behind Jose Schwinard and Surya Bonali. Yet to skate. Chen Lu of China and Nancy Kerrigan of the United States.